Hello all my wet shaving friends. Today we're going to be doing a little domestic experiment and we've got a little box of goodies to open up. Okay, so this all started a few weeks ago when I ran out of shower soap and I filched a bar from uh, one of my family members and it was kind of a revelation. It was a great soap. It smelled incredible and it really elevated my bathing experience. So I asked him, what kind of soap is that? And he said, you don't want that soap. And I said, no, I really, I really want it. And he knew that uh, I'm kind of a cheap, well, frugal person when it comes to things like that. So he said, no, you really don't want this soap. And I said, no, I really want it. He said, well, it's $28 a bar. And I said, you're right, I don't want that soap. <laughs> so, but what the soap was, was uh, this uh, Musco Real uh, soap on a rope. It smells incredible. And like I said, it elevated my experience. But, you know, I'm a, I'm a, a Irish spring type of guy and a head and shoulders or suave shampoo type of guy. So what I did was I got online and I ordered a package of some things that I thought would uh, work, hopefully as well as the Musco soap. Uh, not as expensive because, like I said, I'm not into paying $28 for a bar of soap. So let's take a look at what we've got. Okay, let's see what we have here. Pretty good packing job. Now, the first thing I ordered was, for you wet shavers out there, you're familiar with Taylor of Old Bond Street, and one of my favorites, uh, Taylor Sense, is Eaton College, the Eaton College Collection. And these are my, this is my shaving soap, and I ordered some, some bars of bathing soap. You can see, yeah, it smells great. Uh, and these were on sale. No, they weren't on sale. It was about $8, $9 a bar, so uh, much less expensive than the $28. And uh, this stuff was on sale. This was Body Scrub. Uh, George Trumper. Uh, Again, a name that will be familiar to you wet shavers. This is West Indian... I actually can't hang on, let me get my glasses. The label is so... I can't even read that. Can you read that, Joe? It's the color on the label matches the, the text. West Indian extract of limes. West Indian Extract of Limes Body Scrub. So I'll be using this instead of my Irish Spring. And George Trumper Shampoo. And this is Lemon Shampoo. So what I'm going to do is check all this out. And I will get back to you and let you know if this has elevated my showering experience. Okay, that was refreshing. <laughs> okay, let me give you my general impressions on... Uh, what we just experienced. Uh, the Trumper stuff, the shampoo and the uh, body scrub was kind of disappointing because there was almost no fragrance at all that I could uh, determine. They both seemed to work just fine as the, sh the shampoo felt like it cleaned my hair. The scrub was a little better, had a little more fragrance to it, but kind of a disappointment overall. Uh, the Taylor Roll Bond Street soap was incredible. It's a very high quality soap and it smelled great. Uh, I think the Musco still edges it out a little bit in the fragrance department. There's still a little more fragrance in the Musco, but if you're the kind of person that doesn't want to walk out of the shower smelling like a perfumery, then uh, the tailors might hit the spot. Uh, let, I want to show you a close-up of what this looks like because it's really high quality. Uh, anyway, I think that I will definitely be getting more of the Taylor of Old Bond Street soaps in the future, and it did elevate my showering experience. Uh, and if I can, uh, maybe uh, pick up some of the Musco on sale somewhere. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.